Hello everyone, welcome to Austin Cyber Shop again. Today we have a lot of five Dell Latitudes. Uh, right there are the part numbers D610, D800, uh, 2.13 gigahertz, 1.4, and 2.0, and uh, 1.86. These are as is. I already have one booting up right here using our uh, universal notebook and device power supply. We do sell these as well. They are very handy. Look, they got tell you exactly 18 volts. They have eight little pieces. All right. Um, the hard drives have been removed from uh, from these devices. So we have uh, internal hard drive error. It's telling us to strike F1 key. So just so you guys can see that the keyboard still works. There you go. Let's try F2. All right, keyboard works just fine. Can't really test out the mouse without a without a, a system installed. But these were very popular at one point. The Dell Latitudes, uh, they are nice laptops. Uh, we do actually have a lot of laptop parts for these Dell Latitudes. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and show you the rest of these. One of them has a bad battery. Um, all of them do not have the hard drive, so that is a uh, issue there. Uh, but overall, they're pretty decent laptops. All five of them for two fifty. That's roughly fifty dollars a piece. Uh, you know, as you can see, they're in pretty decent shape. No real damage, damage. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and grab the next one, and I can show you that one as well. Here is the uh, top of it, and immediately right off the bat you can see some blemishes, nothing nothing really too much. Um, these are used, uh, older laptops of course, um, you know they're still not using the uh, widescreen, uh, they're using the 4x3, let's see here, let me go ahead and plug it in, give me one second guys. Alright, there you go, it's plugged in. Let's go ahead and power it on. So you guys can see. Uh, this little universal notebook and device power supply is actually really, really cool. If you guys are missing a uh, power supply, definitely check them out. Um, Alright, so here we go. I think this is the one with the bad battery because it did not turn on. Yep. This is probably the one with the bad battery. Yeah, see, it's it's flashing red on us. So, it has a bad battery, but I'm certain you can definitely find one of these batteries lying around. Yep. Let's go ahead and look at the next one. Here you go. This one seems to have a little blemish right there. Let me show you a little bit closer. Uh, but really not too much. There's a little something there. Uh, it doesn't look too bad though. Really not bad at all. And the screen is intact, of course. Um, every look, everything looks pretty nice on this laptop. Let's go ahead and power it on. And, uh, you know, these are nice little laptops. I'm sure it repaired fully. Um, you put a hard drive in them. You could probably get a good $99 out of each single one of them. Um, you know, there are still laptops. People still do buy these up. And uh, they're really easy to repair from what I can gather. There is a invalid configuration um, information on this one. Please run setup program. I'm not exactly sure how to do that, but like I said, I'm not a repair technician at all. I'm just showing this so you guys can get a kind of an idea of what you're looking at here. We, like I said, we got six watchers on this item. You probably would be interested in them if you're a computer repair place. Uh, $50 each is not that bad. Uh, but then again, once again, we are trying to get rid of these. So if you are very interested in it, please send us an email. Here we go, here's a more recent Dell Latitude. It has the 
16 by 9 uh, top instead of the 4 by 3 you can see this is actually a little bit nicer there are a few scratches right there but and a blemish right there but really really uh, not too bad overall so let's go ahead and open it up um, looks like the keyboard is a little bit dirty nothing uh, some cleaning supplies couldn't can fix uh, except for that one right there it looks like a little bit of wear um, let's go ahead and plug this one up as well and we can see what it looks like when it's turned on Power. All right, look, it's booting. Let's see uh, what comes up. We can go to the BIOS, but we're not going to. Or, I mean, it might just send us there anyways because there's no hard drive in it. Yep, there you go. Time of day not set, invalid configuration information, hard, disk, hard drive disk zero not found. Uh, so yeah, you can definitely tell that the biggest problem here is the hard drives, not so much the screens or anything. Um, but like I said, we do sell a lot of parts like LCD flex screens for these uh, Dell Latitudes. Uh, they were very famous at one point. Lots of people got them. They still have them. Uh, really nice computers actually I had one back in the day let's go ahead this is the very last one right here let's go ahead and turn it on so you guys can see exactly what it's like <clears throat> uh, I didn't show you the 